Dear Diary, something odd happened last night. And I'm... I'm still not sure about it. It... it was a dream. I've been having lots of dreams that I couldn't quite remember. And when I've been waking up... <laughs> there's been blood on the bed. There's a little patch just on my stomach that seems to be weeping. It, 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 it's a bit sore blue. <sighs> I thought it was a just a mark, an infection, a spot. I don't like to show anyone just because of where it is. But Well, last night, perhaps it had been hurting in my sleep, but it seemed to me there was a white cat in the room. A strange white cat, because it had one eye, green, and the other eye, red. And as it came through the moonlight, it seemed to grow bigger, and its teeth longer and sharper, and it climbed on my stomach, and a craw walked bitter patter up to where that bite is, and as I watched, it bit down, and I felt it course through me, and it wasn't as much pain as I thought, but there was something in the pain. It felt like I was giving something blessed, something I ought to give. And as I looked down, it seemed for a moment the cat, the cat had a human head, dark hair, long hair I know so well. And then as I reached down to knock it off, I think, but dreams are so unreliable. It suddenly jumped back and was gone out of the moon. And I fell back into a stupor. Well, this morning I woke up, and it must have been a dream, because my night clothes were on as much as they always were. The window was closed, and in my dream it had been open. But that sore patch, it's raw. And if I'm honest, diary, I'm so tired all the time. So incredibly tired. Except when the moon is shining and she, Camilla, is at my side. And then it feels to me, just for a moment, like my old life can come back. That love can come back. <laughs> I wish I felt joy in the sunlight once again. I wish I did.